Prominent Nigerians have called on various governments to allocate more resources to education to avoid collapsing of the system in the nearest future. Speaking in ONA during a lecture on Pan-Africanism and Humanity, Professor Meiji Akwate of the University of Nigeria in Suka says prioritizing the educational sector will strengthen the institution as well as foster peace and economic development. The Pan-African scholars also believe that the challenges facing Nigeria is not only leadership but institutionalized corruption. Education is a serious matter. You know, there's a, a document of Vatican Council too uh, called Gravissimum Educationis. Gravissimum Educationis. That's the name of the document. It's about education. The grave matter of education. That's the meaning of Gravissimum Educationis. It's grave. It's, the, it's as serious as anything can get. If we don't get it right, we are going nowhere. 1971, Njoku developed a vaccine for cholera in Nigeria. Why are we not participating in, uh, in the search for the, uh, for the vaccine? For the COVID-19. Yes. You go to the university lab, they are empty. They are empty. You know, reagents are used up. You have to, have to be replenished. You know, equipment has got to be. When I was younger, I, I used to project this idea of bad governance, bad governance. Why can't I begin to look inward from the family to the society eh? and to the general public before you get to the government? What transpires in my office? How well am I leading in my office? How well am I teaching my students with all sincerity? How well am I delivering my service without asking for a bribe? in my own office, we should begin to, that is, what Nigeria is facing today is called institutionalized corruption. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.